When I was in Tucson and I found these, I was really excited because they are a quality and a grade of chastolite that I have not seen before. This is a very special stone. It was special to our ancestors. It's a brown stone that, when you have a good quality piece, evidences a perfect cross on the face. Do you see it, the black lines? Right, and when you have a sphere like this, you're gonna get a double cross on both sides. I wish I had more of these, I really do. I tried to bring as many as I could because I knew that you would appreciate, look at the light play there, the quality. You don't often see translucent chastulite like this. And each of them has that light play and that dimensionality. They are so striking and so beautiful. This one even has little hints of like a blush pink. Look at the rainbow there. And then there is your cross. Our ancestors thought these were signs from God when they found them. <clears throat> um, and of course, chastulite, because of the cross, also anchors the four cardinal directions. It's a really strong piece to keep on your altar to ground you, to stabilize you, to help you hold sacred space and stabilize your own container. As you do ritual work, look at the color and the gorgeous markings and translucency. Perfect, again, just perfect crosses on these. And you'll find this and so much more at sagegoddess.com, a beautiful talisman of protection that has been appreciated by our ancestors for thousands of years can be in your hands. No.